The technology that's built into the Leica M11P is a powerful tool. One of my favorite quotes in photography is, is by Henri Cartier-Bresson. He said that to take a great photograph, the photographer has to put their head, their eyes, and their heart in the same alignment. I mean, things about the human experience of being a photographer is that we're not like machines. We, we really have to use our empathy, our, our, um, you know, our minds and our hearts um, to interpret the scene and try to make sense out of it. What I really enjoy is immersing myself into the scene as much as possible, but then just watching things unfold. And that's the part of photography that I, just the experience of taking pictures that I probably enjoy the most. You're looking at the people that you're photographing and you're trying to get a sense of what their experience is like. And um, that, that sort of requires you to, to be as, as human and as compassionate as possible. I'm always trying to bring more of myself now into that interpretation. This is an existential time in photography. The fact that our images are now, when they're disseminated digitally, they're kind of subject to being manipulated by other people. The technology that's built into the Leica M11P is a powerful tool, particularly for photographers like me who work in the documentary and in the photojournalistic space, to secure the provenance and the content credentials with this global standard of the Content Authenticity Initiative. And um, we're able to do this now for the first time the moment we take those pictures. One of the things I love about the new Leica M11P is that it, it now features 256 gigabytes of internal memory. So you're never gonna be caught off guard capturing the amazingly detailed images from its 60 megapixel sensor. When I'm out working, I usually wanna be as unobtrusive as possible. So I really like this new no logo design and the dark chrome viewfinder fits perfectly into my world of photojournalism. One of the pictures uh, that I've taken recently that's very meaningful to me is a picture of, uh, of a woman and her son on a train in Ukraine. Just for those few minutes that she and her son were on the train waiting for it to leave, um, I, I did feel this uh, connection with them and um, I think her expression uh, was very touching and very meaningful um, to me in that moment because I got the sense that she didn't know exactly where she was going and she probably had no idea when she was going to be able to return. Uh, even though a lot of these scenes have been difficult to watch, I feel very privileged to have been able to go and be a witness in these situations. Mm -hmm.